chapter 9 applications of integrations example 9.21 question is evaluate integral 0 to pi x by 1 plus sin x dx. Actually, answer for this question is answer for this question is pi not as a 2. Answer for this question is pi. So, and 2 is a wrong answer. The correct answer is a pi. Solution. First, write the given integral as i. So, i is equal to integral 0 to pi x by 1 plus sin x dx. This is equal to integral 0 to pi x into 1 by 1 plus sin x dx. We take this term 1 by 1 plus sin x as a f of x. Therefore, take f of x is equal to 1 by 1 plus sin x. So, we know one property We know that we know that the property is integral 0 to a x f of x dx is equal to a by 2 integral 0 to a f of x dx. If f of a minus x is equal to f of x. The property is true when f of a minus x is equal to f of x. Our f of x is 1 by 1 plus sin x. Now calculate f of a minus x. Here our a is equal to pi. This is a a. So a is equal to pi. So now do f of a minus x that is pi minus x. So pi minus x this is equal to 1 by 1 plus sin this x is replaced by this x is replaced by pi minus x. This is equal to 1 by 1 plus we know that sin pi minus x is sin x. That is equal to sin x by the rule, all silver teacups rule, we get sin of pi minus x is equal to sin x. This is nothing, it is equal to f of x. So note that here, f of pi minus x is equal to f of x. f of pi minus x is equal to f of x. So, the condition after if is true means the property is also true. 0 to a x f of x dx equal to a by 2 0 to a f of x dx. By that property, by that property we can write our question as a 0 to pi because our a value is pi x f of x. So, our f of x is 1 by 1 plus sin x in the dx equal to a by 2 that is pi by 2 0 to 0 to a so a as a pi f of x so write 1 by 1 plus sin x dx 
also we know one more property so we know one more property the property is the property is 0 to the integral 0 to pi g of sin x dx equal to 2 times integral 0 to pi by 2 g of sin x dx this is a one of the important result this is one of the one of the important result 0 to pi g of sin x dx equal to 2 times 0 to pi by 2 g of sin x dx note that this equation is a number 1 therefore our 1 becomes write this pi by 2 is as it is pi by 2 is as it is 0 to pi 0 to pi x 1 by 1 plus sin x dx is equal to pi by 2 0 to pi by 2 1 by 1 plus sin x dx this pi by 2 is right as it is consider this term so now consider this term consider this term this is the 0 to pi g of sin x dx so for that term for that term we replace the right hand side so for that term we replace the right hand side of the result therefore this pi by 2 is as it is this is equal to the right hand side value is 2 times 2 times 0 to pi by 2 our g of sin x that is 1 by this is a g of sin x 1 by 1 plus sin x dx now these two get cancelled this is equal to pi pi 0 to pi by 2 1 by 1 plus sin x dx so this term is equal to this term is equal to pi 0 to pi by 2 so pi by 2 1 by 1 plus this x is replaced by this x is replaced by pi by 2 minus x into dx because because our result is because our result is integral 0 to a f of x dx equal to integral 0 to a f of a minus x dx a minus x dx so by that property we can write 0 to a f of x dx is equal to 0 to a f of a minus x therefore replace this x by pi by 2 minus x so for that for that place a here pi by 2 therefore our x is replaced by pi by 2 minus x this is equal to this is equal to so pi into 0 to pi by 2 1 by 1 plus sin 90 minus x is cos x so write cos x into dx into dx so now we know one result cos square x is equal to cos square x is equal to 1 plus cos 2x by 2 so 1 plus cos 2x is equal to this 2 goes to left side is a 2 into cos square x so in in your question 1 plus cos x here 1 plus cos 2x therefore our angle is divided by 2 we get 1 plus cos x here also the angle is divided by 2 cos square x by 2 so 2 cos square x by 2 so for that place 1 plus cos x for that place 1 plus cos x we write 2 cos square x by 2 therefore this integral is equal to pi integral 0 to pi by 2 1 by 2 cos square x by 2 into dx this 2 is 
right outside of a integral that is pi by 2 pi by 2 integral 0 to pi by 2 the 1 by cos square x is equal to secant square x by 2 dx so now integrate this term so pi by 2 our integration is that tan x by 2 one more time derivative x by 2 we get 1 by 2 right in denominator the limit is over 0 to pi by 2 here the applied result is integral 0 integral the integral secant square x dx is equal to integral secant square x dx is equal to tan x tan x plus c so now this 1 by 2 is so right in front of the pi by 2 that is pi by 2 into 2 by 1 2 by 1 tan x by 2 the limit is over 0 to pi by 2 this 2 to get cancelled now apply the upper limit and then the lower limit so the upper limit is pi by 2 this is tan pi by 2 by 2 it becomes pi by 4 minus tan 0 we know that tan pi by 4 value is a 1 so 1 minus 0 this is equal to pi therefore this is the result the result for the given question that is 0 to pi x by 1 plus sin x dx 0 to pi x by 1 plus sin x dx is equal to pi. This is the correct answer. This sum is also also do by one more method. So I will teach that method in this next video. So 0 to pi x 1 plus sin x dx is equal to pi. This is the answer. Thank you.